The management at several other apartment complexes could be under investigation facing criminal charges similar to the charge of the apartments at the Jolie is facing. KSLA's Tamer Knight reports. More criminal charges could be announced in the coming days for property owners in Shreveport. KSLA obtained information from city officials who says several other properties are under the radar for blighting. They've been cited for various things by either HUD, Louisiana Housing Corporation, the Housing Authority, or local um, entities uh, for uh, leaking pipes, water running down, uh, the water trash, other uh, different types of debris that may be in their facilities. With this investigation, officials tells us there is a critical housing shortage and Shreveport, and with several properties being in fraction, that number could increase. Probably about uh, 20,000 affordable housing units that are needed in our community already. So in Shreveport, we would estimate that to be about 13 or 14,000. Um, with that said, if we lose about 1,500 units based upon the five units we've already identified, then that would certainly increase that 20,000 number. We also learned that the properties where utilities were shut off are not closed. Property owners could still pay the utility bills and address the needs of the properties that comply with the city ordinances and reopen for renters. Right now we are working with three different uh, apartment complexes to address uh, the conditions uh, in the, in the uh, complexes. There are two others that we've identified prior to this time. And then there's an additional, I think about three to four more that have infractions. Only partial demolition will take place at a few of the properties at the city's expense in July. The city does not have the capacity to demolish the entire property because it is private property. And Shreveport, Tamer Knight, KSLA News 12.